Hello YouTube, this is Cole with Meet the Bible. Thank you for joining me today. I would like to, I'm here at this tower. It's a, a Verizon cell phone tower, Cleveland Crossroads or something uh, near Clayton, North Carolina. Um, it's like 65 degrees out here, late January. Is that, North Carolina is a little piece of paradise, let me tell you. Um, so I'm flying been doing I know some flying videos lately and I'm flying the tower I'm gonna to see if they've turned the electricity on or not because I don't think it'll work otherwise but I thought this would be a good as place as any talk about the Bible or God and President Trump Matthew Gospel of Matthew 16 and 18 and say also unto thee that thou art Peter, and upon this rock I will build my church, and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. You know, I had the truck blocking the wind, and now the wind's coming around here. Um, Donald J. Trump takes the oath of office as the 45th president of the United States. President Trump stated, we will be protected by God. That's a profound statement. Okay, now it's, to me, off to a good start. Anybody can say that, though, can't they? During his inauguration speech, immediately after being sworn in as the 45th President of the United States, Donald J. Trump spoke about how strong the country is when its people are united and that Americans should fear nothing because we are protected by our military, the police, and most importantly, he says, we are protected by God. All right, very profound. To me, as a Christian, that's what we want to hear. Non-believers, secular world, well, doesn't matter, they don't believe. But it shows love shows peace doesn't it you know anybody who, even if you're an atheist do you know a bad christian um i mean they generally treat each other with love and kindness generally i hear these uh f-18 hornets flying over from uh the air force base so i'm trying not to look <laughs> president trump said the bible tells us how good and pleasant it is when God's people live together in unity. We must speak our minds openly, debate our disagreements honestly, and always pursue solidarity, peace. That should be our objective, is to get along. Why can't we just get along? When America is united, America is totally unstoppable, he says. There should be no fear, said Trump. We are protected and always will be protected we will be protected by great men and women of our military law enforcement and most importantly we are protected by God about a minute later Trump made another appeal to unity and he expressed the Christian teachings that all people are created through an act of God quote it's time to remember that old wisdom our soldiers will never forget. Whether That whether we are black or brown or white, we all bleed the same red blood of patriots, said Trump. We will enjoy the same glorious freedoms and we will all salute the same great American flag. And with a child born in the urban sprawl of Detroit or windswept plains of Nebraska, he said, they look up at the sky at night. They fill their hearts with the same dreams. They are infused with the breath of life by the same almighty creator. If you're on this channel, you, uh, I suspect you're a Christian and you believe in Christian values. We need to support this president. We need to find the good in him. Is he flawless? Is he sinless? Eh, probably not. <laughs> we all fall short of the glory of God. 
but let's make 2017 great. I mean, really, let's everybody pitch in to bring peace to America, to bring, uh, to glorify God. I mean, that's what we should be doing, right? Glorifying Jesus. Um, and to make America, gosh, a, a pillar of the world, okay, that everybody will look up to. Each individual, right? Each individual. Um, God bless you. Appreciate you watching. Yeah. Feel free to like. Feel free to subscribe. Uh, we need to get this word out now more than ever. Um, I'm going to try something else with a screen here and some, some other stuff. Team Jesus, God bless. Watch the tower.